All right, in our area, we've got some changes have to talk about. We talked about the cool temperatures. We've got those clouds overhead. 60 degrees in the city right now, cooler than it was yesterday. Want to show you the radar. Dive right in once again. You can see more cloud cover. Look at this. A few, sho few showers in parts of Sullivan County. But this is interesting. To our south, uh, these could impact parts of Ocean County. Seeing a little bit more thunderstorm activity. There is quite a bit of energy affiliated with this system. It's a complex system, dueling lows, bringing the risk of more severe weather for the western lakes down into the Ohio Valley. In our area, we're not talking about severe thunderstorms, but thunderstorms, yes, that means brief heavy rain. Can't rule out a little bit of lightning. So we're thinking, well, yeah, what are we dealing with? It's just an unsettled pattern that sticks around Wednesday, Thursday, Friday with showers. I mean, not no day really is a washout. Ultimately, likely today will be the busiest day, and then it's much cooler. It's going to draw in some really cool air. So I'm going to make some very deliberate stops here, focusing on the Mets. So between, say, 1 and 3, you're going to see the rain try to push in. So timing is going to be crucial. May see a few drops out uh, to City Field, but I think the thunderstorm activity stays south. So it is going to be a close call, but these games are important. Want to get them in now for evening activities, another round of showers. See what I mean? Wednesday's busier with those isolated thunderstorms rumbling through. Thursday morning starts with a shower. Thursday afternoon features a shower or two. Not as much coverage. Friday morning, if you're taking off, we'll miss you over the weekend. But problems with the flights shouldn't be an issue Friday morning. Friday night, yeah, slightly better chance that we could see a shower. And then that should wrap up Saturday. So, I mean, we're dealing with the third wettest spring, and we're dealing with the fifth warmest spring. So if you're thinking, wow, the pollen count is high, that's one of the reasons why. So make sure you have that med, all the meds you need to deal with those big numbers. Numbers, yeah, not as big. Only 51 tomorrow, but Mary, Saturday shaping up and Sunday too, and we should see some seasonal highs this weekend. Watch out for the rain this afternoon. John, thank you.